captain, uh, lady captain, uh, Mr. Vice Captain, um, ladies and gentlemen, um, thank you ever so much for uh, your support today for this um, match with uh, with Marcus. Um, no Marcus now for a few years, uh, and uh, I think you'll all agree to watch how he plays the game is a different way to how I play the game. His <laughs> um, ball striking, uh, amazing, but just as a person, uh, what he's gone through to where he is now, uh, I'm, I'm so, so proud of him. Um, it's, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a big journey, uh, and he's a top man. So, uh, yeah, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for all coming down. Um, I, I did hit some good shots. Did you notice that? Yeah. <laughs> um, but no, I think it's all, as I say, very much uh, Mark and everyone was organised uh, uh, today. Uh, great effort, fantastic effort. Um, and we'll get on to uh, asking Marcus some questions. Is that... Uh, That's fine, yeah. sir. Yeah, of course. I'd just like to thank everyone for coming out today. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, it's really nice, you know, to... All the years of hard work that I put into the game um, to, to get such a crowd to come out and appreciate um, what, what I am producing at the moment and, you know, how I play the game. And, you know, it's great to interact with everybody. And, um, yeah, it's been a real pleasure for me as well as yourselves. Um, to, to come today. And um, I just want to talk about the charity that I support that um, it's fairly recent to me. Um, it's called It's Never You. Uh, it's about basically it's something that's really close to my heart because I lost my mum when I was younger um, to cancer. And um, this charity is basically um, about giving support to people who have lost um, you know loved ones to cancer. Um, the, the fellow um, who runs it he actually lost his six-year-old son last September and he set up this charity and he does an amazing job. Um, and it's called it's, it, it's Never You and it's basically it's a charity to support everybody who's lost somebody um, to cancer, children or you know loved ones. And it's a support centre for them after they've lost somebody to um, you know a support group that they can talk to because there's no help out there. And when I lost my mum, you know, my dad was looking after me and um, you know. He had nobody. He had no way to talk to, and you know when I look back at it now, as being a being a grown man and uh, and look at it, I think, wow, you know, my dad's an unbelievably strong guy to to you know not only look after me but look after himself when he had no support himself. So uh, this charity is it, fairly new to me. I, I use a head cover that's on my driver. Um, fuck you, who um, who, who Siri lost uh, last year, and uh, yeah, so. Thank you so much for the donations for the charity, and, um, and, and I just thought I'd, I'd share with you what, what, what charity I support from now going forward, and you'll see it quite a few times um, on social media posts that I put on. But uh, thank you to everyone for coming out, and uh, I welcome any questions within the meeting. <laughs> <laughs>